please welcome Captain Redneck Dick Murdoch. His opponent, now making their way to the ring, he is accompanied by Gary Hart from Japan, the great Muta. This is our television main event, and we have just seen what that man did to an unsuspecting Missy Hyatt, and to do it to a, a wrestler is one thing, to do it to a lady is another, and it should not go unanswered. As a matter of fact, for you fans that were with us on our national broadcast this past Wednesday night, it really did not go unanswered, and we'll take a look if you did not see that. We'll show you here next week just what transpired in Fort Bragg, North Carolina concerning the great Muta and hot stuff Eddie Gilbert. But a lot of people say, Gary Hart addressed it earlier in the program, that many people think that he sprayed the green, two big doses of it as a matter of fact, that Murdoch in his brawling style, the wily veteran from Canyon, Texas, is the man to break this unbeaten streak. And Murdoch, with 20-plus trips to the Orient, one of the biggest stars in Japan, he knows the Oriental style probably better than any American wrestler currently competing in the NWA. And there you see the veteran manager, Gary Hart, who now not only manages the great Muta, but also the, the big monsters of 6'8", 320, Dan Spivey, and 6'8", 318, Sid Vicious. And we're going to see Vicious in the program here next week, as a matter of fact. Murdoch controlling the great Muta at this point in time. Muta not drag taking over Murdoch into the wrist lock. He's got the big Texan from Canyon, Texas, off his feet. And Big Dick kicks up. He kicks up. 300 pounds shows that great athletic ability that he possesses. Side headlock by the great Muta. Muta has signed, during the Great American Bash, a double jeopardy match with Eddie Gilbert. Now, they're going to flip a coin, I understand, and the winner gets to select his match. Muta's Dragon Shy or Gilbert's Coal Miner's Club. Takeover by Murdoch. Kick by the captain, who's really cooking here. If you join us late, we're going to show you an altercation involving Sting and Terry Funk. That is still to come in this program. And it's certainly worth taking a look at. Talk about all over a, a, an arena and taking some 20-odd people to pull them apart. You'll see what I mean later in the program. Test their strength here. And the Rednecks got a loyal allegiance to fans. Remember, Muta has not been pinned since he joined the NWA. He's undefeated. Who will stop this man? Murdoch wants to do it right here. Yes, sir. That was an all-American move. Murdoch going to the ropes one more time. Nice, deep hip lock takeover by Muta. And a karate kick. Ooh, a vicious karate kick. And Murdoch all the way outside. Well, we know how evil this man is. To try to... And there he, he nails Murdoch downstairs and then up. For a man to spit that slime or whatever it is in the face of a lady is totally unnecessary. I'm sure he was instructed to do that by Gary Hart. And now Muta, the undefeated one taking over on Captain Redneck Dick Murdoch. Big top. And there he's got to stand up. What a slam. Muta, the power drive elbow. And Captain Redneck Dick Murdoch is in trouble here. Muta, look at his hand, his right hand in his mouth, right into the nerve hole. Man, he knows all the pressure points. <laughs> He knows all the pressure points 
and he is so sadistic, perhaps from his, his heritage, perhaps from Batman. I don't know what that means. Hart, Hart used a variety of hand signals to communicate with the Pearl of the Orient. Don't forget here, fans, next week, the dynamic dudes wrestle the New Zealand militia here on the program. Sid Vicious will be here. Wild Bill Irwin on the program. We'll show you some controversial moments from Fort Bragg, North Carolina, involving the U.S. heavyweight champion, Lex Luger. Murdoch ready to fight here. Both men back up to a vertical base. Luger controlling the action with a wrist lock. Turns it another half turn. Murdoch can really feel it. Murdoch has fared better than any other athlete thus far in the NWA versus the great Muda. And now Muda bending the hand back. Look at the, the dangerous position that Murdoch's hand in, was put in just moments ago. And the big 300-pounder from West Texas has got to get back on the attack, and maybe the shortest way to do that is that right hand. There he goes for the Irish win.